Thanks for watching our latest video. In this video, we will install XFCE in Ubuntu 11.10. As you can see, we are back in Ubuntu 11.10 using the standard Unity desktop environment. You can notice the Unity bar down the left hand side of the screen. We will be installing XFCE as an alternate Windows manager. It's lightweight, it's pretty fast. It's lacking on the eye candy, but it's, it's very competent to get the job done. Last video we showed you how to install KDE using the command line. This time we will actually use the Ubuntu Software Center. You'll notice if we just go up and search for XFCE, we'll get the packages we need. Click more info and you will be taken to the section about the XFCE desktop packages. You notice there's a screenshot for what a customized version of the XFCE desktop will look like. It gives some information about it. It is a lightweight desktop. It's fast. Like I said earlier, it's a little lacking on the eye candy. It looks kind of plain, kind of flat, out of box. I think you can do some customization to it, but you're kind of limited. There are some add-on packages you can install. Uh, down at the bottom, I'll tell you how large it is. It's not a very large download. It looks like it's 20 couple meg. I'll take the first option. The enhancements for the XFCE desktop environment. And we will install. Now you'll be prompted for your password. Go ahead and enter in your password and click on authenticate and it's just a waiting game from this point. Uh, it shouldn't take very long, like I said, it's only 20 couple megs of data that's going to be downloaded. That's significantly smaller than KDE was. We'll go ahead and fast forward. Once the installation is complete, we'll be taken back to the Ubuntu Software Center where you'll notice the install button changes to remove and we now have a green check mark saying that it was installed and gives us the date that we installed it on. We'll go ahead and close the Ubuntu Software Center we come up to the top right corner and we will log out. This will take us back to the Ubuntu login screen where we can simply choose the options button to drop down to the XFCE desktop, punch in our password, and we will be logging into our newest XFCE Windows Manager. You will see a prompt that will let you know that this is the first time you're running the panel. So just go ahead and select use default configuration. And here you go, you notice the wallpaper has changed, our menu is now back up in the left corner of the screen. We have a little dot bar at the bottom center of the screen, there's a few icons on the desktop. If you scroll down through the menu, you will notice that we still have all of our settings, all of our packages and programs that we previously installed, just running underneath XFCE now. And of course with the XFCE desktop being so minimal, it makes a great solution for older computers or computers with lower resources. We'll go ahead and log out. Go back to the login screen and verify that we still have our standard Ubuntu with Unity set up. And there we go. You can always find our links to our Twitter, our website, and our Facebook fan page in the description below. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching.